So you didn't notice anything unusual? Is there something wrong? Just seems like it was quite a hefty impact. Uh, yeah, that's probably because of the chair. Uh, sorry, I forgot to say. What chair? Just there was a chair on the floor, so it's probably the height that she fell from, which explains the nature of the in injury to her skull. What was she doing on a chair? Maybe looking at a interesting pattern in the ceiling, or perhaps uh, a spider. Was she putting something in her hatch? Might have been hoarding another crow. Or she could have been getting something out of it. It's a sort of cupboard. What would she want from a cupboard? Well, I'm guessing a quilt or a plate or something. Why would she need a plate? Just to look at it, you know. Take it out, put it back in again. Uh, recreationally. Your nose is bleeding. Is it? Hmm. Strange. She had dementia as well, so... Exactly. Good point, Amy. That's why she was up there, because she was as mad as a hoop. <laughs> She had IBS, too. Yeah. Perhaps not relevant. It's not relevant. Yeah. Nice one, Donald. Really helpful. We have a few more tests to run, but it is quite a severe hemorrhage, so just to give you some warning, the prognosis is looking pretty poor. Are you saying that to make it sound worse than it is so that we don't...? No, I'm not doing that, no. OK, so, so for insurance purposes, so we don't...? She's That's not, not doing, doing that, no. Right, so what is it? 50-50? It's not 50-50, no. So... It's very close to zero. Right. Sorry, I just realised something. Do you write the Grubbs books? Uh, yeah. Ah. Yeah, I do. My daughter loves the acorn conundrum. <laughs> ah. Well, yeah, it's a, it's a fun one. You're taller than I thought you would be. <laughs> yes, I am, yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry. Is that all, Doctor? Because my mother-in-law is dying, if you remember. Sorry. Yes, I'm, I'm sorry. Might be an idea for some of you to go home and get some rest. Perhaps pop in first thing in the morning. No, thank you. We'll all be staying here with Nana, thank you. That's completely up to you. Yes, it is up to us, yes, and that's what we we're saying we will do. It's absolutely fine. Yes, thank you. You said that. I'll see you shortly. Thank you. Thank you. So, is she going to die soon? Quite soon, yes. Have I got time to get a coffee? Ah! Morris! Yes? What's going on? Uh, I'm just drinking a coffee. You all right? Yeah, why? Well, you're forgetting about chairs, your nose is bleeding, and you're drinking your ridiculously big cup of coffee in the middle of the night. Well, uh, I'm drinking it because it's the middle of the night. And, to be honest, I don't know why it's so big either, but it's not my fault. I think we should have a family meeting. About what? I don't know, that's why we should have a meeting. You want to have a meeting to decide what to have a meeting about? Of course I don't want to do that. Why do you always have to twist everything I say? I'm just going to check on Sean. Yes, you go and do that for a change. Go and talk to the one person who can't actually speak English. And enjoy your reservoir of coffee. Sean. So strange, Mr. Prowler. It's put nearly £100 in here. Still not working. Yep. It's because it's broken, Sean. How is grandmother? Yeah, she's not good, I'm afraid. Oh, dear. Look, I need you to do something for me. I need you to hide something for me. Okay. Um, it's a kind of a lasso. Do you know what that is? Yes, mango juice. Uh, no, that's not. No, you're thinking of a lassie. That's a sort of yes. yogurty. Very delicious. Yeah, well. yeah, it's not that. This is a, it's a it's a noose. A ah, chocolate noose. No. Delicious. No, it's not delicious. Ah, not mango juice either. No, back to square one. Ah, yes, square one. It's a rope. It's a hangman's rope. Mm. 